Welcome again to another VG Bust video. We're playing another Harry Potter game. EA Games. It's the Chamber of Secrets for the PS1. I wonder what the secret is. Maybe bad gameplay or horrible <laughs> graphics. <laughs> or you gotta just type in a code to play the game. Uh, we begin with books. <laughs> what is more exciting to children than reading? Harry Potter's first year at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizards. Hogwarts. I am Hogwarts. Along with his friends. <laughs> well, you better go to the doctor and order a cream. <laughs> Lord Voldemort, the greatest dark sorcerer of all time. He was often locked in his room, and even though he was a wizard, he couldn't escape because he wasn't allowed to use magic. Then, one evening towards the end of the summer holidays, a house elf named Dobby appeared. An elf? Dobby warned Harry not to... Oh! <laughs> Looks like he came out of a psych Harry ward. Harry Potter must not go back to Hogwarts. <laughs> if Harry Potter goes back... That's what happened. You do have Hogwarts. Danger. That's there one of the side of the Oh, wow. A plot ...to make most terrible things happen. You, you look Bobby like Barbara Streisand. <laughs> No note, car gone. Out of my mind with worry. It seemed to go on for hours, and Mrs. Weasley had shouted herself hoarse before she turned. To him. <laughs> she she looks like a horse. Me. She does. That is a beautifully sculpted Scottish design house made out of Hello, Lincoln Harry. logs and Burger King it's straws. <laughs> I think it's brilliant. Of course, of course you do. Course he does. <laughs> Look at that Hello. stupid shirt. <laughs> Nintendo. Is that what he said? I think so. Nintendo. Ronald Weasley. Yes, we know his name. I thought you were going to say Ronald Reagan. <laughs> <laughs> You know that they can take the stairs, they don't have to do this? Obviously, or maybe they put their building. Oh, wow! And that's what happened. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look at that, he's really throwing a tantrum. I think somebody said something bad about him. <laughs> Look at that! You know what, he might be a good major league pitcher. Shut him up for a while. I don't know why it's following you. Whoa! Look at that, it's like a Dom de Louise. It really is, it does look like it. I think that is his bladder. Probably why he died, he got Hogwarts on it. I wouldn't talk to her again. Well, back to the vinyl outlet fence. Hello, Harry. Oh! oh. oh. What is he, a uh, English teacher? He has to be, because he's very boring and he's wearing plaid. <laughs> He'll probably give you directions. <laughs> He'll come in the next day and they'll say you did it all wrong. Use your Wingardium Leviosa spell. Mm. Oh, we're getting directions from him. Holding the X button levitates each piece of junk. Use your directional buttons to move the junk about. And Why don't you just a use a hammer? Drop it onto the rocks and they don't the know how to use tools there. Instead, they're using magic that doesn't exist. Oh, don't tell! Oh, don't, don't tell that to David Copperfield. <laughs> don't tell that to Chris Angel either. Don't get mad. <laughs> tell that to Houdini, but I believe magic killed him. <laughs> well, now why are you slamming a classic Zenith TV? Because it's made with tubes. <laughs> That's right, Harry. Keep going. I want transistor TVs. What? Well, some homeless guy might have wanted that. Well, Wingardium Leviosa. What is that? A place in ancient Rome? <laughs> I hope not, because it's probably gone. Well done, Harry. Nice work. You found the denoming gloves. Here they are. 
Oh great, we've completed another useless task. <laughs> Thanks for helping Dad out, Harry. You've also learned how to charm objects. I'm sure that will come in very handy. The sooner we deny him the garden, the sooner we can get some sleep. I'm exhausted. From what? From what? <laughs> Bob Vila does more work than these kids. Uh, what are we gonna do next? Learn how to clip our nails? <laughs> Press the triangle button when you're ready to throw the nun. You get points for distance and hitting the target. What are you throwing? A gnome? Press the triangle button. It looks like it's alive! <laughs> it is. <laughs> <laughs> You know, PETA complained when Mario wore a tanuki suit. Why aren't they complaining about this? <laughs> yeah, wait a minute, what happened? Who complained about the tanuki suit? But that is cruel. PETA. Oh. The, the, um, the animal people. What? This is like, look at this, this thing doesn't want to be thrown. How would you like it? Oh, that looks very painful! <laughs> and he gets a high score. Well, the thing is jumping up and down. Probably saying I have internal bleeding, come help me. Oh, so he's gonna throw another one. Was he getting them out of barrels? I don't even know where that one went! Don't worry, I'll get that one, Harry. Are your glasses broken? Cool! The iron pot is going to have to be in this guard this afternoon. Fred Weasley is a monster tactician. Oh, it's like dueling revolver ocelots. Wait, you should, you should get hit a couple times. It's kind of funny. <laughs> oh, so now, wait a minute. This is little kids getting beaten here. Yeah, this is too violent. And parents complain about their kids playing dodgeball. In gym class, this yeah, is much more violent. Uh, yeah, I know. Parents complain about really stupid stuff, but they don't complain about this. So I wonder if parents are complaining about Justin Bieber getting arrested. <laughs> well done, Harry. Now let's try again. But this time we'll use some special jinxes. Good idea, Fred. See that TV? See the way it's sparkling? That means it's That's got a special jinx in it. That's supposed to be indoors. You don't jinx. jinx them outside. <laughs> no, I don't think they know that. You know what? Oh, there's some special act aspect to this duel that I missed. What's that? I don't have no idea. <laughs> but it doesn't seem any different. <laughs> TV outside. No. And they left a washing machine outside too. See that? I do see that. I don't even think they have washing machines in Scotland. They know that they need to plug that in for it to work. I don't think they understand that yet. They probably have some stupid mechanic working on it. Well, I don't know why it's not working, and you know oh. what's a bigger mystery? I don't know why this cord is here. Oh, that stupid Maytag guy? <laughs> Somebody. I hate him. <laughs> he gets excited over everything. Yeah, why is there a cord here? What is this for? <laughs> wow, it's on the TV, too! Oh, yeah, it's you got plug three prongs! <laughs> and you plug it into the wall. Neato. <laughs> we can get the Zapsons going and get the electricity and get all this great stuff like radio. You mean radio? <laughs> Get ready! Jewel. Oh, this is excessive. Ah! Uh, <laughs> Why are you going after the root beer? Oh, yeah, that's right. Those are the um, urine barrels. <laughs> You're in spiced pepper. Nintendo. Nintendo. 
Press the R1 button to target the washing machine. What is with all this washing machine stuff? What's next? A, a giant refrigerator is going to be in your way? I never ever would have guessed that a boss in a video game would be a washing machine. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Uh-oh. Oh, no. I don't need to hear about his Asperger disease. Okay, that's what I was supposed to do. I don't want to look around. That's all this kid thinks about his Nintendo. I know. There are other there are other systems like Sega Genesis. Sega C D Sega C D. It's very annoying how he picks things up. Yeah, like yeah, there we go. He's a very serious person. Doesn't even know how to joke around. Very exciting. Going from garden to garden. <laughs> fighting appliances. Didn't he ever think of picking that up with his bare hands? He's too fragile. Oh, God. How much was this game? Three ninety nine. I'm sorry. I think. How are clothes hurting him? I think I'm done asking questions. Oh, Harry's dead. That's a shame. Does this mean that we can quit the game? <laughs> <laughs> We're well, look at that. Yeah, he wound up in the Make-A-Wish Foundation. <laughs> <laughs> I have a wish. I w <laughs> can we stop playing this game? <laughs> you want to know what GameSpot gives this game? An 8.9. <laughs> Close. 7.3. I'm actually a little surprised that they didn't give it a higher score. This is just like the other Harry Potter games, as well as some other series, where you go around and do chores. I say kids, <laughs> kids, just make your parents happy and do the chores that they give you. <laughs> you might actually get like a, a better allowance. You might make them happy so they won't yell at you all the time, like they usually do. Yeah. This might shock you. I used to get yelled at a lot. <laughs> I'm sure that shocked the hell out of our audience. Sorry for the delay on GameSpot's review. It had the load. Yeah, their servers are just as bad as their opinions. I give this game my usual. <laughs> 1.0. Just because every time Harry Potter got hit, I found it, I found it amusing. Or else we would be right back in the negatives. I give this a 2.5. Because there's nothing special about or fun about this game. <laughs> Why doing chores isn't fun? Just opening vinyl outlet doors to go from one garden to the next. And destroy barrels with a Nintendo spell. <laughs> oh, what about that other one? That Usham Laviosa. <laughs> <laughs> Some Latin thing that J.K. Rowling lifted. Very creative. <laughs> now, I don't think you're being fair, because you never got to the part with the evil toaster. We got to the washer, but then after the washer, you, you then, then you have to fight a toaster. After the first defeat by the washing machine, <laughs> I had enough. <laughs> that really Even sounds Harry. stupid. <laughs> Even Harry had had enough, and he went to hospice. You, yeah, he did. And now he's in the Make-A-Wish Foundation. 
Oh, here we go. Dare to return to Hogwarts. I had them once. I never want to get them ever again. <laughs> did you get the prescription for the cream? It did. It stung like crazy. <laughs> oh, and then removing them? Oh, it was a very painful experience. Let's see. Be Harry Potter in his second PlayStation adventure. We, it's a very, it's a very good adventure. We endured the first. Honestly, if you want an adventure with washing machines, TVs, just go, go to your local Sears. And get ripped off. And get, get ripped off. Solve the mystery to the Chamber of Secrets, which is speaking Latin and finding urine barrels for lemon spiced cake. Oh, it, but it, it features things. Here we go. What is that? Quidditch League and Flu Powder Travel. I don't know about <laughs> you. It doesn't sound I appealing. I don't want to get flu powder. Where do you put it? On your rumpus? <laughs> New puzzles and wizard games. Not fun ones. Oh, but we get to meet new ugly characters. Including... Gilderoy, Lockhart Dobby, Fox, and Ginny Weasley. Council action adventure game, changing seasons. Oh, that's not a big deal. It's only one player, one block wasted on your memory card. It's rated E for everyone, and it's for EA games, so you know it's kind of shady. Oh, and it's four ninety nine, so I got ripped off five bucks. Folks. We would like to know your opinions of our review. I mean, we could be completely wrong and not know what we're talking Doubt about. Doubt it. <laughs> that isn't a possibility. No. This game so is our, shit. Our viewers that leave us nasty comments, they're all wrong. <laughs> they they're are all wrong. wrong. They are all wrong. They're wrong if they like this game. So folks, just leave your comments and don't forget to subscribe.